Good morning, it's your birthday. You wake up full of hope. One of the first things you always do is check your horoscope. But have you ever wondered how you really got your sign? For us to learn about it, we will have to go back in time. Ancient folks looked up and tracked a path across the sky. Where the sun, the moon, and the planets pass us by. Behind these things, there lie the stars, the different constellations. There are twelve that lie upon this path, according to Western civilization. Do you mean well, those ancient folks from back in time? Track the sun's smooth arc on its way through constellations far and wide. Whichever one was behind the sun on the first day of your life became the constellation associated with your sign. The zodiac, it's where you'll find your sign. So don't try to look at it on your birthday, or the sun could burn your eyes. Wait, I'm confused. About what? For them to know what's behind the sun, was there some kind of trick? That's a real good question. I think it's time we ask our good friend Nick. Hi, Nick. Hi, Nick. What am I doing here? I'm from a completely different YouTube series. Did you happen to hear the song we've been singing so far? We have a question. Yeah, duh. I'm always watching. Well, how do ancient people know which zodiac sign was behind the sun on my birthday? Folks have tracked the positions of everything in the sky For thousands and thousands of years, every day and every night And just before the sun comes up, you can still see some constellations Because of that, you know what comes next in the zodiac rotation in the zodiac, it's where you'll find your sign It's called the path of the Thanks, Nick. Hey, stargazers, that was so much fun. Hey, let's make this a regular thing, huh? I've got a great idea for a sketch about a parking Bye. garage. Bye. Wait, where are you going? His voice is so dreamy. Is it okay to say that? I won't tell him. Well, he is always watching, so. Oh, right. Well, happy birthday, Chris. I love Bye. you. Bye.